Straight up multicolor. Look at that. That's pretty dope. Good morning. It's the day after Christmas and everything in my body wanted to stay in bed today. But when I get up and start my day off with the Lord, just doing my stuff, kind of my alone time in the morning, it really does make a difference in my day. So I had to wrangle my booty out of bed to get up and do devotions this morning. So I'm about to go do that, but I also am gonna be doing a few gift unveilings from this weekend. We were so blessed, unbelievably blessed. This morning you're gonna see an unboxing of something that is almost essential to my mornings. I got so much coffee. I got the most adorable mugs. I also got something else that I'm gonna show you in just a moment that is very, very special. So let's go unbox that and get our morning rolling. So beautiful. So long, farewell, I'll be the same as you, as you, as you, to you and you and you, goodbye, goodbye. You are so beautiful. You are so beautiful to me. Can't you see? You still have your paper wrapping never been touched by human hands out of a factory we can now make beautiful toast together hmm smells a little bit like burning plastic in a factory right now you know first piece of toast kind of like the new car smell the new toaster smell wondering a little bit if i should throw this piece of toast away nah um, maybe this one cooks a little hotter than my old one. Ooh, doggy. I'm gonna have to get a knife for the other one. Well, I guess I inaugurated the toaster. But hey, the alarm didn't go off. This is what Reagan got one of my Christmas gifts. All mama wants is a silent night. I love it so much. So now I'm having my cup, making my cup of coffee with one of my new carrot K-cups in my new mug. So here we are, Jack and I, in our corner. Jack is in heaven. I'm gonna show you one more gift unveiling that is one of the most special things that I received this Christmas, and I got so many special things. I mean, I was blessed beyond measure, and I appreciate them all so much. This gift was one that I received yesterday, and it means the world to me. AJ, who you've met before, she was the one a couple weeks ago that passed her citizenship test. She is battling hard with cancer, really hard. And she is one of the most positive, faith-filled people that I have ever met that's been going through something as difficult as cancer. Yesterday, she had to spend Christmas in the hospital. I actually didn't even know until in the evening when I saw someone post about it on Facebook that they were there praying with her. So thank you girls for being there for her yesterday. They got me this blanket, which Jack obviously loves. Do you love it, Jack? Oh yes, he loves it. They got me this blanket for my corner in the mornings when I read my Bible and it is very special because now every day when I come and sit here, I'm gonna remember to pray for AJ and not only AJ, but Christina and Amy and Abby and their whole family that is going through this difficult thing. But AJ, we love you and we're praying for you. And we know that God is using your life way, way, way more than you think he is. He's using your life because you're touching people. You're touching people with how strong and how brave and how filled with faith you are right now and how much you love Jesus even in the midst of this really hard thing. 
So thank you for my gift and it's gonna remind me every single day while I'm sitting here how special you girls are and to pray for you. Thank you. There's my Christmas present from my muffin because the first one I got was a joke. It was the piddliest little thing I've ever seen in my life. He's still trying to convince me it wasn't bad, but it was bad. It wasn't bad. It's like a toothpick. It's like they put three toothpicks together. It was pretty funny. I love your shirt, Muffin. Courtney and Lee got this for Josh. I don't know if it'll make it in yesterday, so here it is today. Just because I'm a youth pastor doesn't mean I play guitar. And the guy on the shirt looks like Josh. Ooh, I love your shirt. Good. It was a good Christmas. Well, I'm going to be editing most of the day. Because I gave him a lot of footage from Christmas Eve. And? Christmas Day. Yep. <laughs> Which is fine. It just takes time. I'm sorry I gave you so much. And I have today off, so. I had such a full day of joyful living. Yeah. Have fun editing. I am reading my Bible. And then going to put away stuff a -luff. Nice. I unboxed my toaster for them. Ooh. Yes, that was my first... <laughs> You know what? I can't even make toast without burning it in a brand new toaster. <laughs> All right, I gotta get to work. Love you. So I've got my breakfast. I've got my coffee. And be stopping by the office really shortly. Just really quickly grabbing some things. Then I'm headed home and I will be editing most of the day. So I don't know how much I'm gonna be vlogging today, but I'll be editing the got to finish up the Christmas Eve vlog and then finish up the Christmas vlog and hopefully I'll have them both out today uh, well one out today hopefully I'll get the Christmas Eve vlog up by the, uh, noon at least maybe uh, maybe one <laughs> early afternoon then edit the Christmas vlog to post tomorrow morning at 1 a.m. Uh, uh, uh. all right get my coffee Stop by the church and head home. Well, everything's taking a little longer than I expected today, which is okay. It's a pretty chill day. Um, but I just got a whole bunch of stuff set up for my kids from their Christmas presents and those types of things. Now I'm sitting down to edit. So it's going to be a few hours still. But it will be up soon and then we'll be on a regular schedule again because I'm just going to go ahead straight into the next episode and start editing that as well so I don't end up in this situation again. Ah, but today is a lot more chill than yesterday, that is for sure. Look at this cool thing, Amy and Abby, some of my youth. They got me this as a Christmas present. It's so dope. Look at this. You can turn it off. You can make it green, teal, a lavender, or kind of a white, whitish blue. Straight up multicolor. Look at that. That's pretty dope. I was going to leave this at work, but actually... I think I'll see it more here at home. Some of you use it here at home. I like it. That's pretty rad. Thank you, girls. That's pretty rad. Like I said, I am about to get to work. Editing, editing, editing. Yes. I actually enjoy editing. Just I was really, really tired. So Reagan and I are heading out um, for a little shopping for some groceries. So we went grocery shopping on Friday. <laughs> yeah, the lady next to me thinks I'm absolutely out of my mind, which is probably true. But we didn't get groceries for food and we're gonna be home all week. So we're just going to pick up a few food items and we're gonna use Reagan's new cookbook. Six sister stuff. Yes, so we're gonna start and just work through it and we, are doing that with the Pioneer Woman cookbooks too. Reagan has one of her Christmas presents on from Auntie. A brave sweatshirt. Okay, sugar booger, let's hit it. You got your cookbook? Mm -hmm. Last year we spent working through Pioneer Woman cookbook and we still have a lot that we haven't tried yet, but we're excited. <laughs> Sharp white cheddar macaroni and cheese. Mmm. Looks good. <laughs> you gonna put them up there or are you gonna do it separate? Oh wow, look at you, girl. Oh, 
I don't think that's exactly what they want, but. <laughs> Hello, how are you? I'm good. Good. Pretty cool. That moment when you keep hitting the wrong buttons on your camera. Anyway, I just finished the Christmas Eve episode. It's getting dusk outside, as you can see by the blue hue on my face. Is it ever gonna change the white balance? I guess not. Oh well. Just finished that, it's uploading, and I've got the Christmas episode that I'm gonna jump right into, but for now, I'm gonna take a little break, get a snack, maybe even have a little video game break. <laughs> maybe play a couple of rounds of Destiny, or uh, something like Destiny for a little bit, and then get right back into it. It's been a pretty chill day. Oh, all right, back to it. Well, no. Break and snack first, then back to it. You look like Gollum holding you his ring. <laughs> Is Sophie your precious? <laughs> nice. Is Sophie your precious? <laughs> okay. <laughs> That's not creepy even in the slightest. <laughs> like I said, pretty chill day. <laughs> Josh is working on the vlogs. It's a lot of work and I appreciate it a lot. He's been working on the Christmas Eve and Christmas vlog all day. Reagan is in the background watching Shaytards catching up. And we just got back from the grocery store and now we're making dinner and writing out our weekly food um, menu plan because we haven't been home enough to make a menu plan lately. But we're home and we're eating at home and so hopefully it works out. Dinner time, dinner time. I just finished posting two videos. Actually, one won't show up till tomorrow. They're really nice. It's our Christmas Eve and Christmas video. Well, I'm glad you, you like them. You did a good job. And we just want to say thank you guys for watching, liking, subscribing, sharing, and commenting. You guys are awesome, and we will see you tomorrow. Bye. 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 Reagan, come here. Javen, come here. Bye. 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 Bye.